Hi guys, so this is gonna be another unedited video, unedited video with um, my iPhone. I'm such a loser. Um, yeah, still didn't have time to find that charger. My husband took today off, so maybe I should ask him to find it for me. Uh, if I'm not looking in the right area or direction, it's because I'm not sure, because my camera is technically over here, and then I don't know, my screen's over here. If you have an iPhone 4S, you understand, and I'm sorry, I don't, uh, anyways. Okay, so I had my ultrasound today. Um, I'm exactly 10 weeks and one day, and I actually was measuring at 10 weeks and five days, so I kind of lied on my Facebook page. I accidentally wrote, I meant that the baby is measuring three days in ahead, it's actually four days ahead, so that's okay. You know, everything's great. Um, Mystery Baby is an inch and a half right now, healthy, has arms and legs and little earbuds and I got to see it in all different directions and it danced and I took some video, well my husband took some video uh, which usually isn't allowed but we caught some video and once I can figure out how to blur my name and all the information on it I will be posting that. Um, but I did get some ultrasound pictures, I don't know, there it is, in oh crap I'm so bad at this, let me fold this down. Do -do -do. I don't want to show my Okay, so there is the baby in 3D. Come on, Kelly. Really? Alright, maybe that'll work. There's the baby in 3D. Um, I wish... I'm sorry. I'm so bad. This is a horrible video. Okay, hopefully you can't see anything. But you can see the earbud and the arms and the legs and everything. Um, pretty exciting. And then this is one that was just done, you know, regular style. Oh, a little side profile of it. And it's got both of its hands up next to its forehead right now. Or at least it did right then. And then this was another profile shot. So, actually that works out better. I will show you this again, but higher up. See how cute it is? Little earbuds and everything. And apparently my placenta is laying behind it. So, I guess it's a really good thing. So, yeah, I don't know. Um, my uterus is also, 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 also tilted midline now. It's midline, so it's not tilted to my left as much. It still moves, though. When I'm laying, either way, I can still feel it, like, flopping about. So, I think I'm just going to continue sleeping on my right side, even though it's uncomfortable, just for the sake of, you know, just in case. Uh, what else? Um, the ultrasound tech was able to kind of take a look at the nuchal translucency, the, um, the, you know, skin fold at the back of the neck, and I'm still a week early to actually have an accurate look at that. I will be going in next Wednesday, actually, to look at the baby again, and they will do the official NT scan, but as of right now, it's looking great, she said. So, we're very happy. It's really weird because just a few weeks ago, you know, the baby was the fetal pole, and it was like, nothing you know it was just one little pole with little flickering heartbeats so I look like such a crazy person I am looking everywhere but where the camera I think is but oh well anyways so it's really crazy to see the bit that the baby's moving and dancing and has little arms and legs and stuff and it definitely explains why I've been so stinking exhausted all week like I've been just exhausted because I've been growing arms and legs and earbuds so there's that. So we're very excited. We're totally excited. It feels a lot more real now. Not that it didn't before, but it feels just really cool. Um, if you go to my web blog, my www.babybellykellywithani.com, there is a blog posting called My Worries Are My Worries, and it's got some pictures of my son Wyatt's ultrasounds progressively through it, and there's a 10-week of him, and it's so crazy because they look so identical. You know, not obviously the features, but the, you know, the development in them. So I kind of knew what to expect when I went into the ultrasound in terms of what I would see, but it's still cool. So... Anyways, I just wanted to share that information with you. Thanks for everyone who wished me well um, on my Facebook and all of you nice people who are following me. Thank you. And yeah, I will update again on Tuesday. I will be officially 11 weeks and then maybe I'll do another one after my ultrasound next week, my NT scan, but I don't know yet. I kind of feel like, I don't know, I kind of feel like people are kind of getting tired of me <laughs> and so I don't want to bore you all or anything.
when there's nothing really going on. Then, for some reason, like, I don't know, when I get negative comments or negative feedback or dislike, like, I've gone through a lot in the past few years. Well, actually, just in the last decade. And my skin is not as thick as it used to be. So, I don't know. Whenever I put up a new video, it always wear like, it's always, like, heavy on me that somebody might say something mean or I don't know. I don't know. And then I'm overly sensitive because I'm pregnant. So, I just... I don't know how much more I can do, but yeah. So I will definitely do a 11 week though on Tuesday. So I hope you all are doing well. Again, crazy person, don't even know where to look and my phone is shaking, but um, hope you're doing well. And if you're pregnant, hope you're feeling well. And if you're TTC, I wish you luck. And if you're not any of those, hi, <laughs> and hope you're doing well as well. So talk to you later. Bye. 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 I don't know, just bye. <laughs>